this kind of reminds me of the uh, place from season two of the TV program. <laughs> I must say, guys, like it's quite tense, like the kind of quick time events. I was kind of panicking a little bit. This really looks hey, like the place from season I'm two. Run on home. My mom was going to be in a snip. No sweat, man. I'll catch you tomorrow night. It was nice to meet you both. You too. Thank God you're okay. I was worried it'd be bad here too. Been quiet as usual the past couple days. Well, Brecken down the way thinks his mare's gone lame, but that ain't nothing new. I wouldn't have made it back without Chet. Well, I'm glad you took him with you then. You've brought a couple guests. Your boy's a lifesaver. Glad he could be a help to somebody. So it's just <laughs> you and your daughter then. Oh, not his daughter. He's, well, just some guy who found her alone. Honey, do you know this man? Oh, no. Yes. Okay, then. Well, looks like you hurt your leg pretty bad there. Uh, yeah, it's not doing so good. I can help you out. Sean, run on in and check on your sister. You, take a seat up on the porch and I'll go see what I have. Whew. Let's have a look. Yeah, this is swollen to hell. I've got a feeling this guy doesn't trust me. It's not too bad. Tough guy, huh? What did <laughs> you say your name was? It's Lee. Nice to meet you, Lee. I'm Herschel Green. Herschel? How'd this happen? Oh, yeah, that's a guy from season two. Car accident. That's so. Where are you headed before the car accident? I was getting out of Atlanta. The news says stay. Yeah, well, that's a mistake. We hit a guy. One of those things you've been hearing about. On the road. Who are you uh, with, the girl? Should have been truth. Let's, let's be honest. I was with a police officer. He was giving me a ride. Awful nice of him. I'm an awful nice guy. <laughs> I'll pull up with mine. We got another displaced family of three sleeping in the barn. You and your daughter are welcome to rest there when we're done here. I didn't catch your name, darling. Clem... Clementine. Can't imagine what you've been through, Clementine. I'm looking after her until we uh, find her parents. Hey, Dad. So I'm thinking, first thing tomorrow, we got to reinforce the fence around the farm. Mm -hmm. That doesn't seem necessary. I don't know what you saw on TV or heard on the radio, but there's some serious... Shit hitting the fan. I don't think anyone knows how big it is yet. Your son's right. You're going to want to fortify this place. Stuff like that doesn't happen around here, Sean. Dad, I'm serious. Lee, come on. Tell him what you saw out there, man. It's pretty bad, man. I got chased by a couple of dead people. Well, do what you think you should. We got plenty of chores as it is. Lee and those folks in the barn can help out in the morning. We got to do it. Really. I already said okay. Well, I'm all done here. It should start to feel better tomorrow. Thanks. If your leg gets hot or the swelling doesn't go down, you're probably dealing with an infection. Let's just hope it's not one of those infections. They'll probably just have to shoot you. <laughs> we'll clean it, redress it, and you'll be fine. Okay, that'd be preferable. Yeah. There's blankets and such in the barn. We'll be seeing you bright and early. Come tomorrow, which way you think you're headed? Towards Macon, I suppose. Macon's where my guys oh, right Macon's where Lee's from. Ah. It smells like Manure. Manure? <laughs> like when a horse plops? Just like that. <laughs> I missed my 
my mom and dad. I bet, Clem. How far is Savannah? Pretty far. Oh. oh, okay. I don't know my geography of America. Fell asleep pretty quick. <laughs> what did I do? Did you say I love you, Barry? Did I hear that right? Hey, get up. Nice mustache. Ooh. I'm itchy. Well, you slept in a barn, little lady. Lucky you don't have spiders in your hair. <gasps> but I bet your daddy scared them all away, huh? I'm uh, not her dad. Name's Lee. I'm Kenny. Dad, we're in the middle of a fence. There's a tractor and everything. We better get going or we won't hear the end of it. <laughs> hey, That's my boy, go. Ken Jr. We call him Duck, though. Duck? Yeah, nothing bothers him. Like water off a duck's back, you know? Ah, uh, I, I get it. No kidding. But frankly, I think it's because he's dumb as a bag of hammers. Damn! <laughs> but he makes up for it with enthusiasm. Is that his mom? The word is you were on your way to Macon. My well, family's from there. Well, Macon's on the way, and personally, I'd appreciate the company of a guy who can knock a couple of heads together if he has to. I'll see what the girl would like. Ah, gotta consult the missus. I understand. Honey, Duck, this is Lee. And, uh, what's the girl's name? Clementine. Clementine. That is a very pretty name. Thanks. Well, we should get to work. We've all seen what those things can do out there, so the faster we get this fence up, the better. I want to build a fence! Yeah? Well, I need a good foreman. You can sit on the tractor and yell at me whenever I take a water break. On the tractor? Cool! Duck and I will hop to it. Don't put the kid in a tractor. You're just I asking can keep for an trouble. Eye on your little girl here on the porch. We can visit. Right, let's go uh, build a fence, I suppose. Oh, let's talk to. What was his name again? Hey there, uh, Kenny. 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 Need any help? No, I think I got it. Do you need any help? What do you mean? I mean in taking care of that little girl. You know what you're doing? You got kids of your own? Nah, nah, nah no, no kids. kids. Would have liked one then. You know. Mm, How's your son do? doing? Good, I think. Kachi's got a sister up in Memphis. We were coming back from visiting her. We were in a gas station and some guy grabbed my boy. I thought he was kidnapping him. I was on the fucker in about two seconds and... Christ. Just lucky I was there. We saw a lot of bodies before we stumbled upon Herschel's. But... We're a tough family, Lee. Ain't nothing gonna phase us. So what's your family's plan? Get back on down to Lauderdale and let this mess get sorted out. Government will start handing out shots and the National Guard will do its thing. On the odd chance things got too bad, we could hop on my boat, I guess. You've got a boat. Mm, I'm he's a commercial got a boat. fisherman, catching mackerel, dolphin, whatever's biting and paying. Katya wouldn't be wild about it, but the boat's not that bad. See you. Ah, so we know about Kenny's boat. Right, let's go fix the fence. Where's the fence? Oh, there the guy in the tractor. You call this fortifying a fence? You can't just stick planks of wood on a fence. You need barbed wire and cannons and stuff and guns. Do you uh, think this thing will keep them out? Nope, not yet. I'm planning on coming back through on a fortification pass, if you will. We'll lock this place up good. Huh. Sean's still working on that fence. Yes, he is. Hey, Lee. Need a hand? That'd be great. If you could cut those two bites to length, that sure speed things up. Yeah, I can do that. No bother. 
My dad doesn't know how bad it is. No, he doesn't. I saw a guy in Atlanta kill a kid. A boy. Just shot him right in the face. Was the boy one of the walkers? I don't even know. He was either attacking the guy or asking for help. He didn't even hesitate. He just turned, put the barrel of the gun right between the kid's eyes, and pulled the trigger. Uh, you don't see things like that. It's not like in the movies. They don't fall like you think. I don't know, but do I'm kind of alarmed about Duck Kill. on the tractor. Have you had to off one yet? Oh. Uh... I had to shoot one. I could shoot one. Maybe. If it were far away. I'm just glad we're getting this fence built. Dad just wants to keep the family safe and thinks inviting He's not people forget in that. is a bigger threat okay. than whatever's out there. How about yours? How's your family? My brother and parents are in Macon. I hope. Oh man, I hope so too. Maybe it's not too bad there. Yeah, well, here's hoping. That's probably all I need cut for now. Thanks. No problem, mate. Was my pleasure. And Sean, thanks again for the ride. No problem, Lee. Couldn't leave you behind. Anyway, when you see my dad around, he might want some help in the barn. Oh, well, let's go see Herschel. Hey, buddy. I get the feeling this guy does not trust me one bit. How'd you get out of Atlanta? I got a ride and then I was in a wreck. I walked until your boy found me. Hmm. Well, you're no worse for wear. Uh, this farm's a nice plot of land. Huh. Had you told me 20 years ago I'd still be doing this, I would have told you that you were full of crap. Never was a plan, having a place like this. It was in the family, and I guess so was I. Family's important. It's all that matters. You agree with that? Was brought up to, yes. Where's your family now? Parents? Wife? Girlfriend? My parents are in Macon. Yeah, I think we should stick with this story. Well, parents are in Macon. I hope they're all right. But now you've got this little girl to take care of. Clementine, is it? You just stumbled up on her? Yeah. I was looking for help in her house. Hmm. Uh -oh. Can I give you a piece of advice? Uh, sure? Sure. I don't know who you are or what you did. Let's say things don't get better back in the cities, or they get worse before they do. You're going to have to depend on the honesty of strangers if you're going to make it. And if those same people get to questioning yours, you're going to be in trouble. But at least you have the common sense to listen to a man giving you advice. <gasps> what? Did, did Duck drive the tractor into him? I told you not to let that kid operate the tractor. Oh no, it's just a zombie, it's fine. Uh, what did I do? Save him! Right, we've got to go get the other guy. I just leave us then. <gasps> Oh no, it's Herschel's boy.
he's not going to be happy with me at all. Get out. Told you. Get the fuck out of here! Sorry, mate. I'm sorry. Sorry? Your son is alive. You don't get to be sorry. And you! You didn't even try to help. I thought I could help them both. Look at him. You thought wrong. And now... Please... Just go. Oh, I feel really Get bad. And never come back! Is this the first decision I'm gonna regret? <laughs> right, guys, we need to go. Let's... Good luck, Kershaw. Ride to make it if you want it. Right, Clementine, let's go. Herschel, put a bullet in his head before he gets back up.